Hey you guys and welcome back to episode 10 of Combatants Will Be Dispatch where based off the preview I do believe we have quite the spicy episode ahead of us but who knows so if you guys want to watch for anime make sure to check out the link above our sync of age video in 3, 2, 1, go. I know yeah basically I don't think we're actually going to continue with um Agent 6 this week. Oh maybe not. Ooh. Nice. Oh, it's yeah, yeah, yeah. It's finally time for the celebration party. Employee appreciation. This is a pretty solid company. Survival, yes, survival. Oh, could a sex take a break and come party? Where did those come from? Oh. Oh. You aren't evil points. This is going to be a fucking fantastic episode. <laughs> I mean, they have been teasing the um celebration party to us, as well as the fact that these characters are indeed characters that you know, I genuinely thought they were going to troll us and they were just going to be characters from episode one. And that was it. I mean, we've seen them in the end credits, but, you know, the, the waste of, um, you know, the character design, the fantastic character design. I think it would be a waste to, you know, only show them just in episode one as well as the very short preview. So this is going to be that um, full on fan service episode. I, I don't know. Was that it? No, I'm going to be pretty sad if that was it. No, no, I'm pretty sure that this week's title was like, I know, it had something that like didn't have Agent 6 in it. So I'm pretty sure it's a full on fan service episode. I hope, I hope that wasn't just it. No, surely they have to show us the rest of the party, right? That would just be like the biggest fucking cock tease if they just showed that and that was it for the entire episode. No, I do think we are going to have the full-on party and we better because um as i said it is a waste of character design to only show them for one episode that is solely the reason why i think we should have this episode because the character design you know they put time and effort into animating and designing those characters and yes yes we'll be live streamed oh that's why it had the Live. <laughs> hey, it's Tiger Man. Yeah. <laughs> Probably because you always go into the negatives. Wait, that was because Alice. What else? Little. <laughs> Is it perfectly timed with like the was a hot tub streams currently going on? Nope, nope. Okay. What do you mean you're amazing? Amazing, you could tell. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
look look at that little Wait, who's winning? I think it was Bella? Blow. Whose brilliant idea was this? Uh huh. Sweetie, where are those coming from? Oh, they're the cameras. Praise Lola. Where is this live stream? <laughs> I want to read the comments. No, I shouldn't read the comments. And then... Oh, follow and subscribe. What a businesswoman. <laughs> Smart little Lilith. Okay, that's that's great, Tiger Man. But if I didn't realize she had so many. Oh. Well, I mean, if you get those tentacles out. <laughs> no, I think I'm pretty sure it's the camera angles. Yeah, Betty is currently in the lead. Oh, not by much, though. Lilith is last. I give my voice to Lilith. She just wants to know Agent Six's opinion. <laughs> Oh, I see what you're doing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> she is. She is doing a great favor to this entire world. I just think Lilith keeps giving drinks to Hmm. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure it complains a lot. Oh, no, yep. I guess they say love is um, blind. Bl 
Okay, so they have history. Oh! Oh, shit, they don't know it's live stream, do they? Uh-huh. Wait, what? Oh, they're gonna lay off all the Asians. Um... I think she got caught. Uh oh. <laughs> oh shit, so they. Wait! Wait, so we subbed and then the stream ended? No more camera angles? self <laughs> Something nice to her. Mm. This could be dangerous. Which bit? Oh! Oh dear. <gasps> Wait, but what about the bit she said about Is she winning? Why do I feel like she's still not winning? Eh? Lilith? It's Lilith. That was ooh. Yeah, yeah, don't be a sore loser. Did she? <laughs> uh huh, totally. It's more of an experience than we have. Yeah, that's a bit of a... Mm, at least cheat in a bit of a more... A less obvious way. Oof. Of course it was. <laughs> no, Lila. Whoever did the camera angles this week needs a fucking pay rise. <laughs> oh 
<laughs> what? Where, where were you rubbing? Yeah. Oh, um, that, I mean, that's a lot of, this wasn't deliberate, twice, the same thing, so I came up with, of course you know, of course you came up with plan B. How is this one not cheating? Did you not just hack the system again? You hire more agents just for this. Wow. Live. <laughs> I mean, did you really want to win that? Badly. Yeah. Yeah, are you planning on evil points acquired? Wow. I guess Lilith is the crazy tentacle evil lady. Do we, is this something we're like to be? Oh. <laughs> go for it, sweetie, go for it. No, I'm no lollicon. Oof, fire and ice. gift cards i mean yes yeah, that won't pay my bills but sure what Of course, a zoo hero warning. Maybe we'll finally meet the princess's brother. Oh, that would be exciting. Yeah, time's a little too perfect. Oh yeah, good job, Lilith. You didn't, you didn't quite think that one through, did you? No. <laughs> all planned. All freaking planned. But the enemy hero's leader. Grasshopper type... <laughs> Oh, 
I mean, knowing Agent Six, I don't think it was Astro. Astro. Wait, did she just raise her own death flag? Grasshopper heroes, right. Unexpected turn of events, but sure. Wait, oh, that was, that was, wait, that was 20 minutes? What? No. I came for the titties, but surprisingly, they left me with some, some good feels and an epic kind of moment. Wait, so does that mean that we continue on with the war? But yeah, as I was saying, I came for the titties, but I actually left with some good development with our characters. And you know, it was kind of good seeing a all out fan service episode. I'm glad that they did include them, you know, solely for the character design purposes, but also seeing why I like Astro likes Agent Six and just like kind of developing that actual kind of romantic feelings going on because it has been teased to us a couple of times. <gasps> what if she dies? Because, yeah, she's fighting Kira. She raised her own death flag. Yeah. Yeah, what did you do? <laughs> Were you not going to tell us about How to make an evil leader cry. I don't think she does. Not be allowed to go into negative points. He'd never be able to go back to Earth. Oh. S scary lady. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, based on the previous title, it does look like we go back to Agent Six and making a demon lord cry. I wonder if it's that specific demon lord that has been constantly teased throughout the series that will make cry again. Because because I'm pretty sure last week the task that we were left off from him and someone was to feel like the water room before like you know Hine and that new character takes it. So it does look like it's going to be a bit of a heist mission. But at the same time, we do have our three lovely ladies battle going on as well, and hopefully we do get to visit that aspect as as well. But I guess we'll see next week. Until then. Make sure you guys stay awesome and I'll definitely catch you guys then.